the Bible says that in the beginning God created the heavens and the earth. And it shows us the mode of creation that God spoke that let there be in their walls. So he spoke that which was not as though it was and it came to pass. And that is faith. Hebrews 11 verse 1 says, Now faith is being sure of what we hope for and certain of what we don't see. Now what this means is that we have something we are hoping for, either to see or experience. It is not there, but it has to be manifested somehow. So in order for us to see and experience that which isn't there, the invisible things we hope for, we have to be sure and certain that it will or has come to pass. The feeling of being sure or certain is what faith is. There are three things that are involved in order for us to reach the end result of our faith even in the Lord, namely the mind, the heart, and the mouth. One has to think with their mind first and then uh, the heart must create the feeling of uh, sureness and certainty of the things which are thought in the mind so that the mouth can call the things which are not the things that are being thought in the mind which are not as though they are and they shall become. So you think with the mind and believe with the heart then confess the things with the mouth so that they may come to pass. If you need Jesus Christ to come through and show himself strong for you to the glory of God the Father in heaven, there is only one question that he always has for you. And that is the question he asked the blind men when they came to him and asked him to open their eyes that they may see. Jesus said to them, do you believe that I am able to do this? Yes, Lord, we do believe, the blind men said. And then Jesus Christ touched their eyes and said, According to your faith, so shall it be done for you. And their eyes were opened up. You can be healed right now if you believe because according to your faith so shall it be. You can be loosed from every bondage if you believe because according to your faith so shall it be. People had unique encounters with the Lord Jesus Christ in the Bible and each one of them received and experienced the power of God according to their faith. One went and asked him to go to his house and lay his hand on the sick child. Yet another said, just speak the wader and my servant shall be well and another woman said if only I can touch the garment I shall be healed and each one of them received from the Lord what they requested for according to their faith do you believe in God? Do you believe in his son Jesus Christ? Do you need him to come through for you today? You can go to God in prayer believing that you have already received whatever you are asking for in line with his will and it shall be done for you because according to your faith so shall it be done. So shall it be. So shall it be. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, so shall it be. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, so shall it be. Hallelujah. We give praise to our God this morning. Amen and amen.